Yeah, so before we jump into the legislation, Evan, I think that's a really good idea. Let's explain the ban that is currently in place, which this would overturn. Now, right now, the state of California, they've identified 23 states officially right now that boards, organizations, anything, any state groups that may use taxpayer dollars to fund travel, they can't go to about 23 states due to what the state of California has identified as anti-LGBTQ plus laws and or regulations. And that number could even jump up to 26 after today, according to Senate Pro Tem Tony Atkins. So what this Senate bill would do, 447, is actually reverse that travel ban. It would get rid of that travel ban and instead direct the state to start a fund which would go towards uh, funding and encouraging the acceptance of LGBTQ, LGBTQ plus community incentives. Now, according to the office, that fund would go towards messaging, uh, also discouraging discrimination, offering to help those feeling isolated that live in these states. So think of messaging as in billboards, the bus that we saw here earlier with the, the again, the light up messaging, trying to inspire and start campaigns to preach acceptance, but also nonpartisan messaging. More than half of our country is moving backwards. And under current California law, we can't even go there to help or to support those who may be feeling under attack nor can we get there to help widen understanding. And that's why this legislation, SB 447, the bridge project, is so important. And it's already passed the state Senate. Its next leap here would be the state assembly, and then eventually it would go to the governor's desk for signing. Evan and Anna.